Our tale of the tape now for this lightweight championship fight. All right, we send it back inside the octagon here. Is Dean, our Ready. referee for this one. Good. All right, so the rematch is upon us. Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Conor McGregor. Gotta think both sides might change some things up here in advance of the second year. You have to make adjustments if you're going to be successful in a rematch. No two fights are the same. So you have to approach it as if you guys have never fought before. I know the Nurmega Metal Camp has made adjustments. Oh, a beautiful hook by Nurmago Metal. Oh, big hook. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But it's nothing to worry about too much now. But he's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Ooh. Let your hands go. Well, another big moment here from your teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov, DC. Human being bare, but this guy just doesn't seem to matter. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth. This is a full-on brawl, DC. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. Let's go. Circling towards the left now. High volume on both sides, and both of these guys are giving it as good as they're taking it. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Effective use of the jab there by Nurmago Medov. Let's go, let's get those hands going now. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter. A bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Clean with the right hook. That one connected. Under three minutes to go in round one. Game of inches right Damn there, man. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Let's get busy with those hands. McGregor gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Another strike hits that eye area, and it is getting messier by the minute up there. Well, he's getting targeted now. He's been hitting that spot so many times that his opponent sees the cut, and the cut is advancing. So we pull up the stats for you now. 32 total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. Fighting from your range is so important. Beautiful punch lands again. Nice block. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body. He hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Oh, nice left hand there by Conor McGregor. He's still got it. Yeah, he absolutely has it. He's one of those guys that understands distance management better than most fighters. Ninety seconds to go. Oh, nice jab to the dome by Connor. And now that jab starting to get established. And the jab is there yet again. Nicely done on the feet by McGregor. Well, you don't blame him for continuing to badger that cut. Things are getting bloody, champ. Yeah, you got to be careful now because as it bleeds, you got to worry about the blood going into the eye. Now it's time to start being on high alert. And that was a solid kick. Under a minute to go in the round. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Nurmago Medov gets lit up by that straight punch. Well, if you like blood... Perfectly, perfect placement, perfect position. What a huge blow and a big moment in this fight. 
looks like someone took a red sharpie to his side. A lot of bruising courtesy of those body strikes. Well, big kicks, big punches. He's doing everything he told us he intended to do to slow this guy down. And you can see his opponent starting to really be labored in most of his movements. Round right, two next. All right, good news is the round is over. Bad news, oh, McGregor's eye is in real trouble, folks. That does not look good. I wouldn't be at all surprised to see the ringside physician be called on here. He might even stop the fight, we'll see. All right, we'll re-rack some replays from the previous round as they attend to that pretty nasty cut in his eye area. You gotta lock in defensively, man. You cannot be out there just fighting. His opponent is too high level to try to fight him with his ego. Now he's dealing with a nasty cut over his eye. Why do you need another thing to manage when you already got one of the best fighters in the world in front of you? You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, ahead. round two. Nice jab. Beautiful combination there. If you are teaching an up-and-coming fighter about throwing volume strikes effectively, you can do worse than watching the film on this I mean, guy. It's tonight. a master class, John. It's a master class in mixing up the target, mixing up the strikes, and ending your combinations with the kick. Well, Conor McGregor's boxing looks sharp here tonight. We talk about him as a master of distance management, but he also uses his long reach to great effect. It's one thing to have a long reach, it's another to use it and to use that jab, and McGregor has really mastered it when it comes to mixed martial arts. All right, so the hands are crispy tonight. Not exactly what we thought we would see out of this wrestler, but as a former two-time U.S. Olympian yourself with some hands, <laughs> you can fall in love with this. You can fall in love with the striking. He is showing tonight that everything starts with his wrestling. He gives you the level change, which then in turn helps him land in the striking. He looks fantastic. I did not expect him to look this good in the boxing tonight. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Well, good news is he rocked it. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. Oh, so bad. You gotta find safety. Find a way that you can recover. Big, big shots landed by him now. As his opponent postures up, he opens it. Good back and forth action, but they pause things here, DC. They're gonna call in the ringside physician and take a look at what is a nasty cut. Well, he's gotta check on it, because you don't know if the fighter's gonna be able to continue. Fighters always want to fight, but it's up to the ringside physician to tell them if they're capable of it. All right, that is gonna be stop. Man, I knew, these fans I, knew, are I knew he was gonna stop it. You could have let the guy fight. Give him a shot. Give him a shot, John. I don't know, man. Live to fight another day. You could stick three quarters inside that thing. <laughs> we get the official decision with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, the doctor has called a stop to this fight. Declared the winner by TKO and new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle, Hermano Mera. All right, so another huge result for Khabib Nurmagomedov tonight. Certainly was at his mauling best, the conditioning on point as usual. And once again, Khabib proving too much for whomever the opposition is. He just attacks these guys in a way that they can't really keep up with. What a great fighter, Khabib Nurmagomedov. But it's all based and rooted in the preparation. No one prepares harder than the Eagle. And tonight he showed why he's one of the best lightweights in the world.